Well, we're doing full cardiac exams on our gorillas today. Not all of our gorillas, of course, because we've got 24. Um, but the males um, tend to develop heart disease in captivity. So we're the leaders of the Great Ape Heart Project, which is a project to look at hearts in gorillas and orangutans, bonobos, and chimpanzees. Today here at Zoo Atlanta, we've had a great day. Um, we're doing echocardiograms, which is an ultrasound of the heart, and we're also looking at blood pressure, both direct and indirect, to try and correlate what we're doing in awake gorillas, which we're groundbreaking on that at the zoo. You know, some high-profile gorillas died of heart disease, and we started saying, you know, are we missing something? Is this more prevalent than we thought? So about 10 years ago, um, we started really looking hard at gorillas. Now, since we've done that, we've realized that this disease is also affecting all of the apes. And so that's kind of the goal of this project is to say, well, we've, we know a little bit about gorillas because we've been looking at them fairly closely. We don't know much about the other apes as far as normals, abnormals. Is the disease even the same? We have no idea. So this is kind of the start of a new era in research on the ape heart disease. And it's really to benefit them and figure out how can we help these guys? What, what, is there something we don't know that's causing this? We have no idea right now. So we've got several research teams here from um, the University of Georgia Veterinary School out in Athens. Um, we're working with them very closely on this project. Um, and what we're hoping to do is get some normal values for the apes and also to figure out what's causing the heart disease. It's causing such um, morbidity and mortality in these amazing creatures.